Hey, sneak looks back in the house, back in the house. After a long time, it's been a long, God knows how many weeky monthies it's been. A lot of teachers like me are doing, well, I'm doing online stuff for primary. A lot of people aren't, or are only just starting to do it. But anyway, away with that. So I had to reinstall an operating system today. I'll tell you all about that over the weekend, okay? Wasn't very happy. So anyway, I just about got installed everything I needed to. As you know, with Linux, it doesn't take very long. Now, I'm going to open Zoom up for you so you can see. You can't see my face. It's just my penguin and me, okay? Just me. Now, this is the problem I had. I installed the Snap, okay? So it should be fine. Everything should be there. It should be all hunky of the dory, okay? Also, we went in today, at 4.30 today is our um, all-school quiz, so we have a music set, a long music section and then some questions. And they really, really like the music sections, okay? So we have about 12 to 15 tracks, and they have to guess the artist, uh, name of the track, etc. Uh, mums and dads are there, teachers are there, it's great, okay? So, come today, I went to share, okay? So what you do in Zoom, as you should know if you've used it, you can either share your screen, or the whiteboard, or just share your computer sound only, okay? Well, nothing was happening, okay? There was no audio coming out of my computer. Whatever I tried, I even installed some extra codecs, WFmpeg, etc., etc. Weren't playing ball. No. It didn't want to know. No. It didn't want to know. So, I had to uninstall the snap, okay? And I went and got the deb file. And guess what? The deb file works fine. Although it doesn't want to create a nice picture for my shortcut on my bar down here. But that's that's not the point is... Um, I'm not blaming the guy who's made the snap, because it's an unofficial snap, of course. Blah, 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 blah. But if you're really using it for something like we are for education, we really need it to work all the time. And he's probably done it on his own. He doesn't get paid. It's part-time, blah, 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 blah. But when you're doing an install, we really, really, really need it to work the first time we use it, to be honest with you. Really, really do. We come out of that. I'll end the meeting, anyway. Because we don't want to do that, do we? We'll get rid of that. So, yeah. So I, I do the tracks here ready. Ready to play in Audacity or VLC, and we go along, and everybody's happy, hunky dory. So sometimes, even I do like snaps. Don't be it funny, even though it take ages to start. Sometimes uh, it's just the new way of doing it. But sometimes the old ways are the best. Sometimes until they get the speed of snaps up to scratch, it's going to be a slow, long process. Also, when using the snap and we're going to share the screen, actually, I'll just do enough for hang on. If I open up again. So I'll open Zoom up again. Uh, I won't. If I do that, no, I'm not going to do that because you'll get to see me. We don't want that, okay? But if I start the meeting and um, <clears throat> I go to share the screen, it takes like only 20 seconds for everybody to be able to connect. Now, yesterday I had done, uh, was it yesterday? Yeah, year six, and they was all in school. I didn't go to school yesterday. I went on Tuesday to a different school. So I'm leaving it seven days before I go even chance at a different school. And it took about 20 seconds to be able to share my screen. And like, if you imagine you've only got a certain amount of time, we need them seconds. That could be a couple of minutes over the whole class, really. So yeah, that needs to be sorted really quickly. That's just not just for the Zoom snap, but a lot of the others. Gaden Live and whatever. Yeah, it all needs to be sorted. But I'm sure, because I don't mind them, yeah, they're right. I'm sure they will get over that hurdle. They will get over that hurdle and all be hunky-dory, but yeah. That's how we got over it. Went back to a deb. Works super duper. So if you're having the same problem in Linux and you're trying to use Zoom for whatever you do or whatever your company you work for, because it is quite important, or you, if you're using Microsoft Teams, don't forget. Google Meets, I'm not too fond of. Yeah, I'm just, I just, I'm not, basically. No. Just, it's got the potential to be good. It just isn't at the moment. But yeah, that's the fix. Don't get the deb file. Sneaky Linux out. See you guys. Bye bye.